Hello everyone, greetings from Serpent Consulting Services Private Limited. So today we are going to check out uh, our Serve Visa, that's a visa management system. So in this video, we are going to cover the four points. First, we will start with our company introduction. Second, we are also going to check what are the configurations available in visa management system. And the third and fourth, we are going to check how to generate the leads in Serve Visa module. And also, once you generate the leads, how to generate the application for coaching and for visa application. So let's start with our company's website. So we are one of the leading gold partner to Odoo, and we have been in the market more than nine years. And we have already served more than 148 countries with more than 763 plus happy customers. Uh, if you look at our services, uh, we provide offshore services, training services, support and development services. Uh, we provide also technical as well as the functional training. So if you uh, look at our products, we uh, are the present in the different business verticals. So today we are going to check out our visa management system first. So basically, the who needs a visa management system? So visa management system offers convenience CRM to the immigration team. So basically, who can use that? Immigration lawyer, visa consultant, counselor, marketing team, as well as the HR team. So let's uh, log in into our module and we will check how to generate the leads. So once you log in, uh, you can see here the serve visa. So when you open the dashboard, you, you will see all the application details. So first, uh, it's an inquiry type. So how many inquiries you received for coaching and application, you can view on the dashboard. So same with who already registered in the total number of the applications that's for coaching and also the immigration application so that include uh, whether all kinds of visa category uh, like business visa, work visa, visitor, student, or for residence visa. And the university application for especially uh, student visa application, you can check how many students already applied for the university and they are waiting for the offer letter. So that's in a progress. And, uh, they, and who received offer letter, those numbers will be reflected over here. And then the last stage is the visa application. So how many applicants are already in the visa process and how many already received the visa. So all the information you can view on the dashboard. Here we have given the monthly application graph so you can check out like what are the categories and popular in your organization. So you can view that. Also we have yearly pie chart. So so how many applications so basically for like student visa or for business visa you can view from the ramp. so let's first start with the configurations so when you click on the configuration you will see the settings here so first we will check out the sales team so sales team also you can create the multiple sales team within the company or also you can create a multi-company as well so when you click on the create you can get this information you just write it down the sales team name and also you can choose the team leader for specific sales team and you can set up the email alias as well and you can choose company uh, if you are running in the multi companies so you can choose the specific company for the sales team also here you can see the team members so from here directly you can add the team members for specific sales team. So now let's look application stages. So this is basically the application stages will reflect uh, from the uh, different visa application, whether it's a work visa or like student visa. So you can also create uh, as per your requirement. Here we have given the application, university, visa processing and approved visa. So if the application in the uh, first stage, PR, student or work visa, so once you generate the application, it will reflect in this stage. So here you can see university option is only for allowed for student visa. So we have create here student visa. If you wanna add something else, you just click here and just select this one. So it automatically reflected here. So same with these are the stages. 
and now let's check the coaching stages so coaching stages basically is required for if you are providing the coaching services so for those who come for the inquiry you that will come as a apply for coaching if they registered with you then you can just grab them uh, just move them to the register as a student and as uh, if he is interested to make further process for any visa application you can directly generate the application so you don't have to create again lead for specific uh, uh, visa application so here you can see inquiry for coaching so this is the inquiry for coaching so if you're providing different uh, services for coaching services so there are lots of exams like ilts toefl pt those are the examples like there are other requirements like gre set you can also create directly from here that is required when you generate the leads you need to fill out the details for specific application let's check out the university so university is very important when you apply for a student visa so when you generate the application in which university you have tie up you just give the details here and you can also add the phone number website and address for specific university so those universities leads you just create the university so yeah whatever the requirements you have or you have a tie up with the universities you can just create here so now we will check the inquiry type so inquiry type when you uh, filling the data for specific application uh, that is a one field will ask you whether the lead received from where whether it's received from website or whether it's you received a call or it is like walk-in direct inquiries so you can also create if you if you provide like social media you can just create social media or Facebook you can add those inquiry types as well so here you can see the courses so courses which is important when you are filling the data for student visa or any other application uh, what the client has already studied you can choose those courses here so we have set up here four courses now look at the degree so degree is also like he has done bachelor of science you can just create bachelor of engineering as per your requirement and types of visa so here we have given what kind of visas the service you provide so you can just create this visa so once you create you just uh, write it down the name and it will automatically will reflect it so here uh, you can see the course choice so course choice is very important when you are generating the lead for student visa so course choice option will give client so what they are planning to go for further studies so whether it's a degree diploma graduate diploma or postgraduate diploma you can create from there so here also we have given field choice whether he is going to do the master of engineering or whether he is going to do the science you can just create here same with the degree choices whether it's a master of science master of like engineering you can just create those ones and here we have given the internet social media and media advertisement so those are the reference so when you do the internet reference you can add those details in the uh, application like from the where the lead will generate it all right so those are the configurations fields we have available so now let's check out here is the services part so if you go first is a dashboard so what we have already gone through the dashboard and now we will go through the leads so leads here you can see the all the leads details and if you want to create you just create here so i will show you how to generate the leads and for the coaching as well so let's uh, look at create lead so when you create a lead you will get this form so if you can see here there are save discard generate application option is available or sometimes leads can be generated from the website as well so if anyone fill out the form from your website and they just put the details it will automatically here so let's create a new one so here if i'm say he is need for student visa and here i'm just going any random name 
So somewhat ah. Uh, So the blue mark, which you can see, those are the mandatory fields. So here you can put the date, it's a today's date. Address, you can add the address. And if they have any website, you can put the website as well. So here is the main important thing, whether he is applying for coaching or for visa. So you can just choose whether it's a lead from coaching or application. I'm just selecting application here. So next contact date. If you want to put you can add over here what is the job position of applicant you can just choose here so I'm just putting random mobile number here and priority it's like how the uh, leads priority you can just uh, give ratings over here text is very important whether he is applying for a student visa and if he is also looking for like uh, coaching as well so you can add those coaching as a tag as well so when you search it would be very easy to find late so here you can see there is a personal details you can choose the personal details as well here I'm just uh, selecting date of birth of the client so here you can see there is education details you can also add uh, like what course is name degree status with the university name and start date and end date so now same here the experience details also you can add the experience details which is very important for a uh, different visa category like for student visa as well as the work visa and visa details and country selection so here you can add whether which country is going to choices you can add here as well and also you can if he already applied for any country before you can select and which country you can choose and which year you can also select as well and also not forget what type of visa he already applied for there so exam score if you can see exam score we have added multiple exams here so if you select ilts exam the scores will be reflected so here i'm just putting random 77 course so automatically the total score will be calculated and as we seen in the configuration, the reference and queries, you can add the reference from here as well. And if you want to ask any questions specific, you can choose those questions as well. So once you save this, so once you save this, all right. So once you save this, it will generate lead. So if you go in a services and go in a lead, you can see here the somewhat. So what date you created, you can view over here as well. And the application type, whether it's a coaching or application. Inquiry type, if you have put this details, will be reflected here. And opportunity is what we have put in the description. So if I'll open this lead directly, same with, we can also applied for the coaching as well so i will show you how i'm um, just opening the coaching lead so if you add it so if you select the coaching there won't be any more information you will receive here like education details or work experience or visa details because there is no need for that so here inquiry for you can choose what we have created in from the configuration part and here is the most important thing when you create a lead the automatic email will be sent to client so this is the template you can choose and here we have given option for uh, send message so this is basically if you want to send an email to your clients you can just directly send message and whatever you type here and place send the email automatically will send to your client so main important thing is for counselor is the log not so log note is very important. So whatever the communication you had, and communicate with the client, I'm just tapping here. He will get back to us after five days. And if you just log here, so it's a two days, what we have added the log note and noted by whom as I'm logging from administrator. So you can see the administrator name here 
and the other thing is if you want to get back to us after five days you can schedule an activity here so activity you can choose like i need to make a call on date of 18 if you want to add some knots here you can add the knots as well and you can just press schedule so when you schedule it will show here so do you need this you need to call for administrator and once you do that you can also mark or also you can edit this schedule activity as well so once you save this so when you go at the clock over here it will show you one in future so when you click on one in the future so whatever we have planned in the future will reflect it over here and here you can see the green mark which deletes already schedule and activity for that so here we have seen the leads how to generate the leads for coaching as well as from the application and we also check out the configuration in the next video we are also going to see the flow of coaching application and as well as the visa application for different categories so thank you so much for for being here thank you so much